This is Sean Stellato with SES Sports, NFL Sports Agent, and you're watching Peyton Priv TV. Viva Italia! Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to Peyton Priv TV. I'm Peyton Privatera here with NFL agent Sean Stellato from SES Sports. Sean, Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas. Thank you for coming in. It's a pleasure to have you. Uh, now, you represent a lot of different players across the NFL, which include New England Patriots standout, defensive player and special teamer, two-time champion Brandon King. Brandon King, he's uh, a Swiss Army knife. Two-time Super Bowl champion. He's a winner on and off the field, and uh, he's a pro's pro ideal client. He's a phenomenal player. I love watching him every Sunday. But I also want to talk to you about some of your new, younger, up-and-coming players. Right now, I want to ask you about Chris Manhurts, who plays for the Jaguars, and his you know, inspiring story. Yeah, Chris, I'll tell you right now, if you look in the definition of persistence in the dictionary, his picture is going to be there. Um, he is the starting tight end for the Jacksonville Jaguars. Uh, Chris never played football in his life. First game of football was in the NFL. He was a Division I basketball player, and he is... Plays like a grizzly bear, but he'll hold the door for your mother. And uh, just an all-around amazing player. Uh, he's great for the game, and he's a rare bread. There's not a lot of true blocking tight ends in the National Football League. He does it very well, and uh, he's an ideal client. For this year's draft, as you mentioned, some younger guys. E.J. Perry, I mean, he's broken every passing record in, in Massachusetts high school football. And uh, out of Brown, but Division One pedigree. He has such a rare traits of athleticism and intelligence. He's going to be great for the NFL. Uh, he plays, you know, in the East West Shrine game next month. He's training down in Florida, and uh, he is uh, he's going to wow a lot of GMs. There is a deficiency in the quarterback position, I think, on backups. Sean, I've been able to see some of EJ this season at Brown. Obviously won every award there is to win in the Ivy League, just a special talent. I think everybody at home has to, that's a name to watch for, EJ Perry in this year's draft. Yep, I could, you couldn't have said it better. Uh, he definitely, uh, uncle had to move over on the mantle. Sean, next I want to ask you about Detroit Lions cornerback Ifatu Melifonwu, who I believe is from around here, correct? Yeah, he's from Grafton, Mass. Ifatu, you know, another rare uh, gem. I mean, what I mean by that, just the athletic traits alone, uh, it just stands out. You know, long cornerback with range, position flex, great team's value. They're going to do big things in Detroit. Coach Campbell's really got them in a lot of games, and, and I think he's going to bring back the fan base at, to another level. He fought to is going to have a huge role. Let's face it, these receivers in today's game, they're big, they're fast. It's a height, weight, speed game, and he's got the ability to you know cover and, and make plays as, as, and show up in the tackling game, which is really important. Obviously, Melifon would make a big difference there in Detroit. One last player I want to ask you about is Jaden Graham on Atlanta. Yeah, Jaden, I'll tell you, I like the wicked smart kids. Uh, Jaden is uh, he's a tight end, but the thing about Jaden that's really impressive is that he has uh, you know the ability to catch the football, ability to play special teams, and uh, his mental side of things is, is just incredible. Story just it resonates with every American underdog. Uh, this is a kid that you know barely got in the league. We had to beg for a couple tryouts and uh, he went in and did what he needed to do and Scott Pioli, uh, you know my fellow uh, National Italian American Sports Hall of Fame inductee, uh, he gave him a shot at a tryout and Jaden went in there and knocked the cover off the ball and uh, yeah he's been a backup tight end for the Falcons scoring touchdowns on Thanksgiving Day. Um, I think this, you know, it's funny. The Kansas City Chiefs tried to trade for Jaden the year they won the Super Bowl, and uh, Atlanta wouldn't let him go. So they see the value in him, and um, I'm, I'm very excited for his future. Uh, he's an All-American kid with uh, a lot of upside. Sean, Merry Christmas. We'd like to thank you for coming in and giving us your time. My pleasure. Merry Christmas to you. Happy New Year. And uh, this is Boy Wonder up and coming. I'm excited. He, you know, he thought that highly to bring me on, and uh, I, I strongly recommend you follow him. I strongly suggest you watch Peyton Priv TV, Boy Wonder right here, uh, up and coming. He's the next Sean McVay on the media side of things. Folks, you're watching Peyton Priv TV. Merry Christmas, Happy New Year, and we will see you next time. Viva Italia.